Hello guys and welcome back to another play of you on the channel. Today we've got Team of the Year Ribbery Icon who I actually packed. I still can't believe it, I'm so gassed. Untradeable, but still, he looks like one of the best cards on the game, doesn't he? Um, so if you do enjoy today's play of you know what to do, smash the thumbs up button for me, it's greatly appreciated. And if you're new around here, please do subscribe to the channel for more play reviews and FIFA related content. So obviously with these team of the year icons and team of the year players, they seem to have uh, all two uh, playstyle pluses, which Ribery has two of the best on the game, which we'll get into in a moment. Um, He's five foot seven, five star, five star, high medium work rate, and he's going for about 2.6 to 2.7 million right now. He can play left wing and left mid, and his stats look absolutely insane. 93 acceleration, 91 sprint speed, his shooting category is absolutely stacked. Uh, 89 attack position, 90 finishing, 87 shot power, 93 long shots, 92 volleys, 86 penalties, passing unbelievable, dribbling obviously just sensational. There's just so many superlatives for his in-game stats. Uh, a couple of things that obviously are a bit of a con with the card. Heading accuracy and jumping there. He's not going to win you any headers anytime soon with 52 heading and 55 jumping. Stamina of 86 is pretty good, but the strength of 69 and aggression of 68. Obviously, he's going to get pushed off the ball very easily. Uh, but he does come with finesse shot plus and technical plus which is just insane two of the best um play style pluses to have he also has some other insane uh, just play styles that being quick step travella uh, fleur incisive pass and the dead ball play style so his play styles and play style pluses are absolutely insane this is the team going to use him in he's going to be playing on that left wing hopefully cutting in and scoring a load of finesse shots but Gonna be linking up with Sam Kerr, who if you've not seen the video of me packing both of these players, I did pack Sam Kerr as well. So if you do want to see a Sam Kerr review, please do let me know. Uh, but yeah, it's the first first game of using these two, so I cannot wait to get into it. But if you do need coins to buy players like this, then check out our sponsor, u7buy.com, and you just go Josh97 to get yourself a cheeky 6% off at checkout. All the links you need are in the description below. Without further ado, let's get on into the review of team of the year icon ribbery here we go first game it started off really poor with his defense and then he comes up with a holly ginola and his team looks pretty good to be fair so let's see what ribbery can do in this first game hoping that he can give us a master class oh lovely play into Dalgleish, cuts inside, finesse shot from Dalgleish and an assist from Ribery. Lovely play with the skill move to provide some space and then a lovely through ball to Dalgleish who can finish it off. The first bit of uh, involvement in the game there from Ribery and it was a lovely assist as well. There we go, first goal from Ribery. Took it fantastically on that left foot. Absolutely smacks it into the back of the net in the perfect position there. To be honest, I hope the cross from Salah would have been better. So we could have done like a Fleur goal or something like that. But we do get the goal with Ribery, which is nice. Oh, beautiful again from Ribery. Quick two goals there, one after the other. And that one was a finesse shot flying into the back of the net. Really nice goal, that. Oh, decent effort from outside the box there with the finesse shot from Ribery. We are getting absolutely battered in this game. Can't lie. Oh, lovely ball into Ribery. But Walker just gets in front of him there. Very unlucky. Frank Ribery, absolutely superb there. Little one-two with Dalgleish, finds the space. And with that finesse shot plus, it's going in the back of the net. There's his hat trick in this game. Absolutely fantastic from him. Three goals and an assist. And that was taken really nicely there. Really good goal. So we end up getting beaten this one 6-4. But I think Ribery is going to pick up the match ball. Might not. You might not see that. But he did get three goals and an assist. And played absolutely phenomenally in this game. We could have got absolutely hammered. His pace feels nice. His dribbling is insane. Because obviously he's got that low centre of gravity. Um, as well 
has obviously really nice dribbling stats. He can turn people inside out. He's got the passing. He's got it all for a winger, lad. He feels like a Neymar reborn, doesn't he? Obviously, Neymar, not that good this year unless you get some of uh, his fire or freeze, whatever it's called, version. But it's like a re... It's Neymar. That's how he feels. He feels like Neymar previous FIFAs. Uh, he's so good. But obviously, we're going to have a few more games of him. So here we go into match number two. He's got a couple of evolution in the not the best team in the world at this stage in the game. So hopefully Ribery can uh, rip this team to shreds because he certainly did the other game. But obviously we did lose. So hopefully we'll get a win in this one. Oh, Frank Ribery absolutely ripping the defender there and then smacks it into the back of the net. This man is special. <laughs> he really is special. That's his uh, fourth goal of the review. I mean, we really shouldn't have done that. We could have just had a shot with Dalglish, but Ribery does get the goal, and it is a Fleur goal. What a volley that is. I honestly thought Tabernay would have done better with that, to be fair, but Ribery puts it in the back of the net yet again. His finishing is incredible. Oh, look how close. The close control is just fabulous. And again, another goal from Frank Ribery. Absolutely insane. It's the dribbling. Honest to God, he's like a magnet to his foot. He is Neymar. Revitalised, rebirthed, whatever you want to say. He just feels so, so good. And he also has the benefit of having set pieces as well, doesn't he? With the dead ball plus. Look at that for a cross. Straight onto Balak's head and another assist for him. Honest to God, this man is actually insane. Oh, that would have finished the game off, wouldn't it, right there? So unlucky from Ribery. But we do get a rage quit anyway, and I'm not surprised because Ribery absolutely destroyed him. Let's have a look at the performances. I think he got three goals and an assist. Yes, he did. Absolutely fantastic. 10 out of 10 performance. This guy is genuinely incredible. Here we go into the final game of the review. Pretty nice team. I mean, he's got Jersey Dude, Spaghetti Legs himself in net, but... Hopefully we can get past the spaghetti legs and score another hat-trick. Can we get a triple hat-trick review with Ribery? That's the question. He's got a hat-trick in the first two games he's played. Can he get one in this final one? Not many players do, but I have had some players who have. Can Ribery be one of them? Oh, lovely play. Lovely play. Let's use that pace. Oh, absolutely mugged off. The finish, though, was not great. But he did just absolutely mug off the defenders there, didn't he? Fran Ribery, team of the year icon. Take a bow. Good night, Vienna. What a goal that is. Rage quit as well. I mean, if that doesn't sum up Ribery, I don't know what will. Absolutely fantastic performances from him. Let's get on into the player summary of Frank Ribery. So here we are, my overall thoughts and opinions of Frank Ribery. Three games, seven goals and two assists. Incredible performances from him. This man is genuinely perfection he's so good lads he's so good no wonder he goes for so many coins and i am so lucky to have packed this man i mean he's got it all for a winger he really has he's got the pace he's got the dribbling he's got the shooting he's got the passing and he's also got finesse shot plus which you just seen there coming in very handy with that amazing finesse shot outside the box and technical dribbler as well two of the best playstyle pluses you can have on any card and he's got both of them he's absolutely insane genuinely insane the only cons with him obviously he's very weak he's gonna get pushed off the ball very easily if they can get near him that is um, and he's not gonna win you any headers anytime soon but they are very minor cons I and mean, a mean minor for this card genuinely insane 
One of the best cards I've used. He's so good. He's so fun. With the five star, five star as well. I mean, in game you could play him at striker if you wanted to. You could play him at left wing, right wing, central cam, wherever. He will do you the absolute business. He's got it all. He's fantastic. Go and buy him. Go and try him. You'll not be disappointed. And he's getting a 10 out of 10 rating from me. Fantastic for him. I've just, there's not enough superlatives in the dictionary to describe how good this man was in the review. Absolutely fantastic. He will do you the business it really will uh, so i hope you guys have enjoyed today's play review if you have smashed that thumbs up button for me it's greatly appreciated if you're new around here please do subscribe to the channel for more play reviews and fifa related content go and check out when they actually pat this man because the reaction was insane and if you do need the coins to buy him because he's a lot of coins then check out our sponsor use them and use the code josh97 to get yourself a cheeky six percent off at the checkout all links you need are in the description below and I will catch you all in the next review. See you later.